What is up, Dream Media family? This is Zach. Welcome back to another episode. Today, I have a beautiful home theater to showcase here in Fairview, Texas. This is a wicked 7.6.6 Dolby Atmos system with a 150 inch picture. I can't wait to get into all the details after the intro. Let's go! Welcome back guys. Before we get into this video, I did want to point out that Dream Media is nationwide and a lot of the products you're seeing in this video are part of our Dream Media Plus program. If you're interested in learning more, reach out and schedule a free video consultation with one of our specialists. Also, you can shop on our website now at shopdreammedia.com. All right, let's get into this build. So the homeowner reached out to us because every other home theater company told him no. They said, Dick, you cannot build a killer home theater system in this room. The space actually has metal framing inside of the walls, which is a huge obstacle. So as part of the design plan for this space, we included framing, which we were able to hide all of our wiring into, and it added a nice design element to the space as well. To complement the design of the space and add to the acoustic properties of the room, we installed a variety of different acoustic treatments throughout the space. We have absorption, the cinema rounds, we have the Wavewood diffusers, and we have the multi-diffuser DC3s at the rear of the room, in addition to their bass traps to help with the performance of the audio system. Now let's talk about the speakers a little bit. We have the full Sonos Faber 7.6.6 Dolby Atmos system. The middle number is the number of subs, and the last number is the number of overhead Atmos speakers. So the subs are actually handled by SVS, and I'll talk about that here in a minute. For our bed layer, our seven channel system, we have the Olympica Nova 5s for our front left and right, and the Olympica Nova C2 for our center speaker. These things are classic, beautiful aesthetics and high performing speakers. For our surrounds, we have our Olympica Nova Ws for our surrounds and our surround rears. This is gonna be for low level effects, such as a car screeching around a corner or bullets flying around the room. Now for our overhead speakers, we have the Palladio 662s, a total of six, and this is for our overhead Atmos, such as rain, thunder, planes, helicopters, anything that would have come from above you in the scene. Now, let's talk about the base. We have six subwoofers in this room, guys. At the front of the room, two of the PB16 Ultras from SVS, and then right to the left and right of our primary seating area, because we couldn't put them at the rear of the room, we have four, two on each side of the PB4000s from SVS to deliver our heart pounding bass. All right, now let's talk about our video. This has the JVC RS3000, which is gonna provide our beautiful 4K image with their world-renowned DILA technology for our inky black levels and tack shark image. We're broadcasting that onto a massive 150 inch 240 aspect ratio Stewart film screens projector screen. Now, when you're running a 240 screen, there are some things to consider. If you look at the JVC RS3000, we have a special lens from Panamorph on there. This lens does a couple different things. It increases the brightness of the projector as well as it scales it perfectly for 2.4 image movie watching. Now that piece in combination with our Lumigen, which handles all of our aspect ratio switching, makes it to where the customer doesn't have to lift a finger as he switches from movies to TV shows to sports. You may be able to tell on your TV in your living room, but when you're watching movies, it's typically outputting in a 235 or 240 aspect ratio, which is why you get black bars top and bottom. 
With these two products, you're able to eliminate those black bars and maximize the brightness in every pixel that your projector is outputting. Now let's talk about the audio. We are using the state-of-the-art audio processor, the Trinov Altitude 16. This is the best of the best when it comes to audio processing. And we paired that together for our amplification with the Audio Control Avalon G4s for our Class H amplification. And no system is complete without a quality source. Whenever you're building a high performance home theater, it's crucial that you have a high quality source to start with so that you maximize the potential of all the other equipment in the space. We are using a Ravion X200 4K Blu-ray player. And all of our equipment is being held in the strong 42U Signature Series rack. I love these racks because they have a lot of different options for you to adjust your equipment up, down, forward, back, and hold high-end, really heavy equipment like the audio control and trend knob unit. The Strong Signature Series rack also has built-in ventilation to ensure that all of our equipment stays cool and running for years to come. The customer was told he couldn't put a home theater in this space because the whole room is framed out with metal. I'm gonna be bringing him on so that he can talk a little bit more about the complexities of the room and some of the challenges that he faced whenever building the space out. When we first bought this house, I really wanted to have an audio video room up here and I've been watching a lot of your videos. And I was like, man, I feel like I already know Zach. I was being told by everybody, you can't put a system in this room because there's too much metal. I was told no by everybody. And they're saying, get a couple of monitors in the front of the room, get a big 85 inch TV and forget about it. You're just done. So I don't want to do that. I've been really looking forward to this for many, many years. But what bothered me was these guys are willing to just let me go. When I got a hold of Kellen, every time I had a question, Kellen actually had a really good answer. Long story short, we got to designing it and then your guys started running wires. Kellen's good, man. Kellen's good. But he saved me so much money on the projector and then put the panamorpha lens on it, 30% more light, and it works like a champ. Kellen and Zach, it's unbelievable. The questions and they answer the phone. That's another thing. Every time I call, they answer the phone. Every time I text, they get right back with me. Kellen was on the way to the hospital one time with a friend. He was taking someone to the hospital and I sent him a text. He took the time to call me. He said, oh, I'm on the way to the hospital. I said, what? So I said, go to the hospital. <laughs> Don't talk to me, but that's the type of service that I get from these guys. It's really been a learning experience, but it's been a lot of money saved. Kellen made this whole thing work within a budget. It's unbelievable how how uh, Dream Media has put this whole thing together. It's been, it's been wonderful. It really, really has. I wouldn't just give up. Don't just give up. Talk to them. Let them at least consult with you. It's free, right? See what they say. They'll get on a Zoom call with you. They have folks probably in your community that can come out. That's what I did. I'll never go, but I'll never turn to another company again. You guys are great, man. I'm serious. You guys are great. All right, guys, that is a wrap on the tour of this beautiful home theater in Fairview, Texas. I hope that you guys enjoyed this tour and found inspiration into something that you could do in your own home. If you liked this video, give me a big thumbs up and be sure to smash that subscribe button down below for more. If you're interested in us doing something like this for you, reach out today for a free video consultation with one of our specialists. Or you can head over to our website at shockdreammedia.com. Till next time, this is Zach with Dream Media Home Theater. Thank you for watching.